In this video, I'm going to show you how to back up your Samsung Galaxy phone or tablet to your Mac computer. Let's get into it. First thing you want to do is go to your browser. I'm using Chrome for this example. And then go into the search, type in Samsung Smart Switch, then search. And you want to choose the first result, which is the Samsung website. Select that. And then go to Mac OS Download right here. And the file will download. And then you want to click on the file. And then double click right here. And allow. Next, continue. Continue. And agree to the license agreement right here and then click continue to install for all users and then install you're gonna have to enter your password for the installation so enter your password then click install software and the software installation will begin after the installation is successful you'll have to hit restart right here so you're gonna go ahead and restart the computer and then we'll come back after the computer is restarted so after restart you want to go to finder so i'll just come here finder and applications samsung smart switch folder open samsung smart switch and agree to the terms here you get this pop-up don't plug in your phone yet and go to open system settings and there's a pop-up at the back here that you need to get to so let me move this out of the way you need to turn these on so these are all samsung drivers you need to enable that one so you enter your password or touch id so i'm using password right here so i'm going to enter my password and then enter all the drivers so each one you're going to require a password so just keep doing that and this is very important if you don't do this it won't work and there's a total of five of them and hit done right here and then over on this one you're going to hit okay and just hit okay and okay and okay and after this you close this window then you can plug your phone in or your tablet whichever one you want to back up just wait for it to detect it and if it's locked as it says here just unlock it and now you have the screen right here so on this screen, okay, just allow. And on this screen, you you can go ahead and back up or restore or even open your file browser. So one of the things you can do, if you have a MacBook that doesn't have enough space on it, you can also back up to a hard drive, external hard drive. So you can go to Smart Switch right here, go to Settings, and then you can do where the backup file is, select like backup file, and you can change the actual location. So it's gonna be saved in CSA Tech Link, which is my folder, Samsung Smart Switch. You can actually change it, and I can make it to be one of my drives here. So I could make it this drive too. Let's send it to the Samsung drive or one of them. You can just make it any drive you want. So I'm gonna cancel this because I'm gonna keep it on the MacBook itself. So if you wanna encrypt the data, you can select this radio button right here and select OK. I'm gonna encrypt mine. I'm just gonna leave it as it is because I just wanna do a backup. And then select OK and confirm. Now you can hit backup right here. And here on the screen, you can select what you really wanna backup. So all the categories of items right here can back up your messages, apps, home screen, everything, the videos, audio. So for time, I'm not gonna back up everything because all my backup would be probably, I think it's 170 something gigs right now. So I'm just gonna use images as the demo. So I'm gonna uncheck this, select images, and then hit backup. And it's gonna index my S23 Ultra and load the files, the files that is needs to backup. So, so right here now, it's actually checking my phone and it's gonna load the files. And you should see on the phone, you see transferring your data on the phone. So here it's loading it, right? And it's gonna say you have 20 minutes left. It's not gonna take that long. I've done this before. It's gonna take about three or four minutes for the 4,964 files I have here. So I'll get back to you when it's at say 97, 98%. So now we're at 99%. It took about three minutes to be done. And now it's saying successfully backed up. So now you can see my photos here, all 4,964 at 14.03 gigabytes, all backed up. I just hit OK and you're backed up. If you want to restore this data, you just hit, simply hit restore and it's going to give you all the restoration points that you have made on your phone. So here, this is today's February 23 and this is the restoration that I did today. I did one in January. So if you want this one, this one, you can do that. So all you have to do is select it and hit restore. I'm not gonna restore it because this was for demo purposes. So that's how you can back up your Samsung Galaxy devices to your Apple MacBook or iMac. Thank you for watching. If you find this useful, please consider subscribing to my channel.